Very good evening and welcome back to the Shere Bangla National Stadium for the presentation ceremony of this fourth T20 International of the Bangla Bandha T20 Series. Uh, this is uh, presented by Alicia Card and powered by Walton. Well, Bangladesh have done it again. They have just taken the series after winning this one by six wickets. Bangladesh are 3-1 up in this series against the New Zealand team. Well, I have uh, the New Zealand captain Tom Latham waiting for me. Uh, Tom, first thing is that not enough runs on the board initially. Uh, no, we're probably slightly under par. Um, we did know that um, the, the comms back to, to the guys were that probably wasn't quite as good as the last couple of wickets. So uh, we were sort of looking around that 100, 110, um, but unfortunately it was just a, a little bit too light. And uh, credit to the way Bangladesh uh, batted this evening. I thought the way they controlled the innings, uh, even though we took a few early wickets, uh, you know, they had that under control. So cr full credit to them. A lot, a lot of positives to take away, particularly when you're talking in terms of taking wickets. They did give Bangladesh a run for their money and you've taken the game right to the last over. Yeah, it's something that we, we spoke about. Uh, we knew if we bowled well, then, um, then it would it'd be a competitive score. And, and we did take those early wickets up front, but they managed to, to build a couple of partnerships there um, through the middle. And uh, the way Mamadoula finished it off was, uh, you know, credit, credit to them. So, but certainly very pleasing from our point of view, uh, the way we stuck in there. As you said, we took it to the last over, uh, which is very pleasing. So uh, certainly a lot of positives to take out of the last couple of games. Just going back to your batting innings, I think... Uh you know, the continuation that you had in the previous game, 52, 62 for 5, and then turning it around to 128. But today it did not happen, though Will Young really made a very good concerted effort. Yeah, and that's something that we spoke about. Um, you know, Youngie played a, a good innings there for us to, to get us to a competitive score. And uh, unfortunately, we did keep uh, losing wickets and clumps. And, and over here, um, it certainly makes it hard to, uh, to keep the momentum going through the innings. So, um, but credit to Youngie, he stuck out there and, um, and managed to get us to a competitive score. But unfortunately, it just wasn't quite enough. Yeah, it wasn't, unfortunately, but it's a bad day at the office, but you still have a game to go, looking forward to that and trying to take the positives from here and make a few adjustments for the last game? Yeah, definitely. I think, um, you know, the way we've been able to, to adjust slightly on, on each different surface, um, a young group that hasn't played a, a lot of international cricket and, um, and not many of us have been here before. So, um, you know, it's important that we do take those little things out of each game and, and hopefully uh, in game five we can put close to a perfect performance together and, and Hopefully we can finish the series 3-2. Well, we hope so too. Thank you for your time, Tom Latham. And Cheers. best of Thank luck you. to you. Thank you. Right, so that's uh, the New Zealand skipper, Tom Latham. Now we have got that uh, award, uh, the Walton Most Valuable Player of the Match, an award of 1,000 US dollars. And for his exemplary batting, taking his team to a win. It goes to Mahmoud al the captain of Bangladesh. 43, not out. And he finish it with a flourish. He's just going to collect, uh, well, stand behind that dummy check. And uh, that is it uh, from him for the moment. We'll call him back once again. Right, the big uh, award, the Alicia Card, player of the match, an award once again of 1,000 US dollars. Nasu Mohamed, who broke the back of the New Zealand batting, uh, takes it. Onikane Kohinondo Nasu Abaru, player of the match, Hawaii, Ki Onubuti Hotse. Assalamu alaikum. Onubuti Ashule, Sidista Jitsi Alhamdulillah. You go ahead, accurate আর আমি ওইটা চেষ্টা করি যাতে রান কম দিয়ে ওভারটা শেষ করে যাওয়া যায় এবং যখন দেখা যায় যখন উইকেটে একটু সাহায্য পায় তখন স্বাভাবিকভাবে একটা কঠিন উইকেট হলে অনেক কষ্ট করতে হয় তো ন্যাচারাল বোলিংটা করার ব্যাপারে নিয়ন্ত্রিত বোলিং আমরা যেটা বলি সেটা করতে তো সক্ষমতা একটু বেড়ে যায় নাকি আসলে উইকেটে টান পাইতেছিলাম তাই চেষ্টা করছি যে একটা জায়গায় বল করার জন্য উল্টাপাল্টা কিছু চিন্তা করি নাই একটা জায়গায় বল করে গেছি কোন উল্টাপাল্টা কিছু দরকার ছিল না নাসু মাহমুদ অনেক অনেক অভিনন্দন আমরা আশা করি আরো ভবিষ্যতে আরো অনেক অ্যাওয়ার্ডস নিয়ে আসেন আপনি বাংলাদেশের জন্য ইনশাআল্লাহ অনেক ধন্যবাদ অনেক ধন্যবাদ আসসালামু আলাইকুম ওয়া আলাইকুম আসসালাম Anik Dhanwa, thank you very much. Nasu Muhammad, very, very humble person. He just said that he just went about doing the basic stride. There's no pressure from uh, the captain with regard to taking the wickets. Well, we'll soon find out what the captain thought of that. And uh, the captain of Bangladesh, Mahmoud Lalariyad, is uh, requested to come across and have a few words. 
Well, uh, Mahmudullah, let's uh, just go through the match. Uh, you, you're pretty happy with the bowlers restricting them to a low total initially. Definitely. I think um, the bowlers did a great job once again, uh, giving us a low total. And it was, uh, it was a good total to chase down. Credit goes all the bowlers, especially Nasum, the way he bowled. Um, made the ball exceptionally well. Fizi is uh, all, the, all the way exceptional. All the bowlers, uh, Saif, Saqib, all the bowlers bowled really well. Yes, they did indeed. And particularly Mustafa Rahman, you just mentioned 4 for 12 along with 4 for 10 by Nazum. And that gave you that, that momentum, that confidence. Uh, were you a little disappointed in how the, the way that uh, you went about getting those runs? No, not really. I think uh, the batters uh, tried their heart out. Uh, we just need a good partnership in the middle. Uh, me and Naim tried to build up a partnership. Naim batted really well. Um, Afif uh, finished it off uh, quite well. And uh, we just needed that one partnership uh, to chase that down. And also, uh, on this kind of uh, wicket, understandably, you have to craft a bit. You've got to really batten down, be very selective with your shot making. That is something that you managed to uh, get from some of the batters. Definitely, I think we needed a partnership. That's what I've mentioned. Uh, we just need to build up, build up the partner partnerships, tens, twenties, or thirties. Build as much as we can. Uh, then later on, try to take deep uh, the game as uh, as much as we can, and then we take it from from there. Well, you're making it a habit of creating history. You beat the Australians 4-1. You're already 3-1 up and taking the series. That must give you a, a very, very wonderful feeling. Definitely. I think it credit goes all the uh, team management and all the boys, the way they fought, the way they uh, came uh, today. And uh, the hunger was there to win the game and try to seal the series uh, today. And you've sealed it today. I'm sure you want to finish with a flourish uh, by winning the last game. Definitely. There's uh, one more opportunity to win the game for Bangladesh and hopefully we'll uh, regroup together and try to find out the areas that we can improve and uh, try to be positive and keep thinking uh, good things so that uh, we are confident to win the game. Well, let's hope that way. Marvellous job done by you and your team. Congratulations and thank you for talking to us. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mahmoud Al-Riyad. Well, and that is it from the presentation. Uh, Bangladesh uh, creating history by winning their first ever T20 series against the Black Caps, New Zealand 93 all out Bangladesh in the end 96 for 4 Bangladesh.